It's that time of the year when we start looking out for beautiful and cute hairstyles for our girls. I totally understand the hassle of looking for something new, something we are not already familiar with, and I'm here to help you all out. So I decided to begin this holiday hairstyle series where I'll be sharing beautiful and easy hairstyles weekly till Christmas. You can choose from them and recreate one for your girls. This is already sounding so exciting. <laughs> So with no further ado, let us begin with the first episode of the series, okay? As usual, I already moisturize her hair with just water, but soon we'll be changing that water to something else, okay? Like, not in this video, but very soon I'll be showing you guys something new that we can be using in place of water. And right now, I am trying to divide her hair, like to part out her hair, then slick down with some shine and jam for more easy parting. So what I'm doing here is, like, I'll section out a, you know, a part and I'll put it into a rubber band, like, small quantity not too big not too small just an average size okay because that's the style we are going for i don't want the hair to be too scanty or too full just somewhere in between So I did the whole ear to ear cutting for three lines, that is three steps and I went on ahead and started this straight line on top like this, okay? And for this particular line, I will part into three, I will divide this one into three, I will have three, um, three bones or whatever in, in this one, okay? In this one alone. For this last line i parted into two as you can see and if you guys notice i'm not going for a particular pattern like a center pattern or a side pattern i mean the style i'm going for don't necessarily have to be a center pattern but if you can achieve a center pattern go for it okay yeah just go for it but for my i am definitely not going for a center pattern probably let's say maybe a side pattern or something <laughs> <laughs> anyways that is it i am done with this part of this towel okay and in total i have seven parted lines that is three ear to ear and four at the middle or four at the center if that makes sense and i'm using brazilian wool for this hairstyle of course so right now i'm unraveling it so i can put it into use but one thing to note is that the length of this wool that i unraveled is Kind of longer than what i wanted okay so i ended up cutting out a little bit yeah i cut out a little bit i will be leaving the length that i use on this cream i will measure that out so you guys can get the actual length that i got for this hairstyle and after that i will go ahead and start brushing out this part is essential is important i'll start brushing it out so it can be all flopped and not have that blunt edge you know what i mean so it doesn't have a blunt end because of the style we are going for to begin the next stage of this hairstyle we'll be needing a crochet needle first i'll comb back the hair and then i'll pass my crochet needle through her hair underneath the rubber band that i tied earlier and then i will you know pass out i'll put some quantity of brazilian wool onto the crochet needle pass it out then put another quantity of brazilian wool on top of her hair and start braiding don't worry i will explain more later i know i'm fast with this explanation but definitely i will explain more later i'll braid almost to the end but not completely almost almost to the end then bend over at this stage and start wrapping around the braid and again i will tie with the rubber band just to secure it but even though you decide not to tie with a rubber band it is still secured okay but you know she's a child you know how kids are with hairs 
that is why i want it to be extremely secured and also to add a bit of color to the hairstyle so let me go through with this explanation once again first of all i'll pass my crochet needle underneath her hair and put some quantity of the extension that is the brazilian wool onto the um the crochet needle pass it out and put another quantity of the extension we're using small quantities okay and i will start braiding i'll braid till i get to where her hair ends and add a bit of extension like a small quantity of the brazilian wool extension then continue braiding one thing to notice here is that i didn't begin braiding with large quantity of extensions that is because since i'm braiding with her hair from the roots it will appear to be chunky like the addition of her hair will make the braid to look big from the roots and thin out as i braid on so to prevent that i decided to add more extension where her hair ends I don't know if i'm making sense like i added more extension like this that extension you guys saw me add later on i added it at the point her hair ended you guys know her hair is short this applies to long hair too so if your child's hair is long you do the same you braid till you get to where her hair ends and add more extensions am i making sense but in case your child's hair is that long to the point that is the same length as the braid i mean no need what's the need the whole point of adding extra is so that everything will be uniform you know yeah Ta-da! 
and i am done you guys so right now i am oiling her scalp which is also essential with this diy oil that i made myself if you haven't seen the video of how i made this oil do check it out scroll down my channel or check in my description box i'll be leaving the link there also and after that i decided to trim off the excess not like there are much i mean i i use the brazilian wool which doesn't produce like a lot of extra hairs on top so and also i'll go ahead to lay down her edges and everything good and you guys this is it i decided to start it like this just pack it up and left some <laughs> and just left some and it looks so good look at my baby girl see how this hairstyle suits her so much see how her edges are well laid down and i'm so excited that i get to try out this hairstyle on my daughter this is my first time attempting this hairstyle considering the fact that this is a trending one and considering the fact also that it is not made with this extension nah it is not made with this extension i couldn't get the extension it is originally made with but this brazilian wool worked out so i am proud of myself okay and also this is like a big babe's hairstyle and you making it on your baby girl this festive season is a win-win <laughs> it's not easy okay it's not easy so we've come to the end of this video if you watch to this point do give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't share my video and I love see you, still you in my next I'm one bye bye till the end of time i won't change my mind